In other global news, UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak has said that United Kingdom will hopefully begin deporting asylum seekers to Rwanda in the spring season. This was the real timeline for Sunak's asylum scheme, which is currently being debated in Parliament. The UK government hopes that one last push can revive its stalled plan to send some asylum seekers on a one-way trip to Rwanda. Yeah, I'm still committed to the timeline that I set out previously, which was we aim to get a flight off in the spring. It's important that we get the Rwanda scheme up and running because we need to have a deterrent. We need to make it clear that if you come here illegally, you won't be able to stay and we will be able to remove you. That is the only way to properly solve the issue of illegal migration. Now, we've made good progress. Boat numbers were down by a third last year, so that shows that our plan is working. The British government is planning to pay asylum seekers up to over $3,000 to move to Rwanda under a voluntary plan. Rishi Sunak administration says that this plan will help clear the backlog of refugees whose applications to remain in the country were rejected. Now, Britain and Rwanda signed a deal almost two years ago. However, no migrant has been sent to Rwanda under the agreement yet. Last year, UK Supreme Court had stated that deporting migrants to the African nation was unsafe. Lawmakers in the House of Commons are due to consider changes made to the safety of the Rwanda Bill by Parliament's upper chamber, the House of Lords.